they get on you don't have to give them money and unfortunately that's a road that a lot of us go down I did when I first come here I lost a few thousand pounds giving money away when I first come you know um, now with hindsight some of that money I wouldn't have spent um, it's just something you've, you've got to learn and you can listen to other people but if you're like me you don't listen to anybody you do what you want in the end anyway uh, and hopefully we'll learn by our mistakes but you know the whole point of this is please please be careful because again just recently I've had three messages from three different people to it seems to be mainly United States uh, because most of the guys that come here are from the US and they've had some really bad experiences you know there's another guy just recently had to go back to the US he spent all his savings everything and now he's living in rental because he, he sold his house built this this girl uh, a house on land he bought and then as soon as everything was finished she didn't want to know so you've got to be so careful guys because I mean I've said this before if Mal all of a sudden turned around and said look you know I've lied to you I don't love you I don't want you anymore I'm stuffed I mean what do I do yeah what do I do you know do I, do I put this in my suitcase and and that in my suitcase and this in my suitcase you know the the things that I feel are personal to me I, I can't do it I wouldn't I don't think I think I'd try and stay here how I do it though I don't know because I'd be stuffed I've got to support my kids how would I support my kids you know how do I look after myself well, separately and support very, my kids very bad. And then uh, even you, you not uh, do anything for me, like I'm lying, just to be uh, make you miserable, and then I go to immigration to, uh, you know what I mean? Ooh, that's <laughs> new. Ah, you you no, sneaky little spray, monkey. Just for example, learn. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, so what you're saying is, yeah, but if 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 she's nasty to me and I go and try and live here then she'll go to immig immigration, immigration tell them we're no longer out. together yeah. and then I'm put back on an expensive tourist visa <laughs> oh thank you babe oh, oh. never thought of that one <laughs> anyway the next project is my computer now thanks very much to uh, Elgin, 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 I'm, I'm sure it's Elgin, Elgin brought me my new motherboard which is in there from the States and he also brought me my new CPU cooler um, because I had this on on the CPU it wasn't getting hot it was it was it was really very good I didn't need to change that but it was taking up a lot of space in there so if I needed to do any maintenance and cleaning it just got in the way so I thought I'll get get something new so I've replaced the cooling system on the CPU to a water based system I've replaced the motherboard from this one which is the Gigabyte Ultra Gaming to this one and I replaced the power supply now to those who are looking at this video saying well why you done that what are you on about this got hit by lightning and there was a big crack and the computer went dead and I assumed wrongly it was a power supply so the first thing I bought was a new power supply I put that in it's not working so then I asked Elgin to um, bring me the motherboard and the the new um, cooler for the CPU. Uh, not that that makes any difference to it working. Obviously, it was the motherboard that was the main thing. So I put it all together. I've switched it on, and nothing. Now I've had these. I've been to a, a computer store and had these checked. They're fine. So there's nothing wrong with the memory. 
There's nothing wrong with the onboard battery, obviously this is a new board. I checked the battery on the other one and I checked these so I knew it wasn't my memory cards etc. So sadly the only thing it can be is the processor. Now when I took the processor out underneath on the pins it was all, all discoloured. Now at that point I'd got the new motherboard. Now if if I hadn't had the motherboard I would have gone for the processor. Um, now you'll get say why didn't you take the processor? Well you know hindsight's a wonderful thing isn't it and these things are pretty tricky to sort out. Um, so anyway sod's law I've replaced all that and it's none of that and it was very expensive to replace obviously. So I need a new processor and unfortunately that's it it's gonna have to stay here because I cannot afford another processor I've took a lot of money away from the family that you know we needed for other things but Mel insisted because we need this computer up and running because if the laptop goes down which it, it's gonna go down I'm surprised it's still going already I, st I keep having trouble I keep having to reinstall windows with it constantly um, and I wanted this as a backup yeah I've gone a bit overboard with it but when it was working before it got struck it was brilliant absolutely brilliant I could play me old computer games from when I was in the UK and uh, I really enjoyed it now you know at the end of the day as well guys you come to the Philippines and a lot of guys have said the same thing I said you know oh, I, I, I don't need much if I've got a roof over my head and some you know a fan to cool me down and I can eat you know or I can manage over there yeah you can for a while but then boredom sets in it does set in you've got to have something to do now my passion is my computer and it has been for years hasn't it Mel? Yeah, and, then the 3D printer. and now my 3D printer which I've wanted for ages now oh guys by the way if you're gonna get a 3 if you want a 3D printer get a Prusa uh, Prusa 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 PR Prusa P-R-U Prusa P-R-U-S-A <laughs> get a, a Prusa 3 um, it basically works out the box you don't have to do a lot to it the only downfall to it is it's not a, a big printing area like this one is this is the big one of the biggest printing area I think it's the CR um, CR S5 that's bigger than this one this is like 300 by 300 by 400 and the CR10 S5 is 400 by 400 by 500 it's pretty damn big so that's it guys I'm not gonna bore you any further before that before that oh yeah thank you Bill for that cross angel Bill, Bill sent this for my yeah. baby and she, yeah she loves it thanks very much Bill and what was I going to say? Ice candy. Yeah, <laughs> ice candy, ice candy, ice candy. So it's ice candy. So I took everything out of here and I'll put a picture up to show you what it should look like. And all these wires went into the back of here and it was a right mess and it took up all this space here. So now I've got rid of this. There's all this space now. Plus I can lift this and move it round and not have to lift this up at the same time so it i love it i absolutely love it i can't wait till my terminator skull is uh, done and this is a base but i've got to do the base again because this is the base for it but it lifted off the bed on the corner so i'm going to redo it because i want perfect i don't want it'll do so this this side lifted off the bed here on this corner so it's all bent so I'm redoing that and then of course it's all going to get rubbed down and painted 
and then I'm going to put lights in it. I'm going to put lights in his eyes so it lights up with some little LEDs and uh, I love it. It just it gives me something to do when I've got a minute but I've not got that many spare minutes with the kids now. Both, both of them are really poorly at the moment. He's got a chest infection. He's got a cold. Yeah, and now she's got a chest infection and she's got a cold. So she's crying all the time when she's not asleep. I said the right opposite of Matthew. Yeah. With Matthew's baby, she's a, God, she's a handful. She's very, very, very good. Yeah, she's keeping us awake at night. He never kept us awake at night, did he? He slept all through the night. Really good. But now, now he's walking, you've got to have eyes in the back of your backside, haven't you? Yeah. So that's it guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video, it's not been too boring, it's been informative. Yeah. Um, we've done this because we can't get out for the rain. It's raining, yeah, even it's raining there's somebody by ice candy. Yeah, yeah, that's amazing, isn't it? Ice candy, ice candy, ice candy all the time. We're not complaining, it's great. <laughs> Sometimes stressful. Yeah. Like for example, can I buy ice candy? You need to ask. Oh, how many? Yeah. Oh God, yeah, yeah. Do you know? Do you know what really it's makes? Really you because oh. you have no patience, right? They'll come. Yeah. They'll come to the door, right? And they'll say, "Babele, uh, ice, ice candy pa, ice candy pa, ice candy, ice candy lang." Wow, ice candy lang, and it's. And you're waiting for them to tell you how much, how many, sorry. You've got to ask them how many they want. Every time. Yeah. Do you know the times I've walked to the, the, the freezer, brought one back, and they've said, Six. no, do I? Or, or a, a pat or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, how crazy is that? So that's something else I've, I've found that uh, makes me laugh a bit. Yeah. So it's over to you, babe. Please hit the like button and please subscribe and share our videos. And don't forget, guys, go over to our new revamped website that Christopher Monk has yeah. revamped for me. And uh, there's loads of information on there about getting married and this, that, and the other, and all nice stories about Naga that might coax you, might uh, prompt you to want to come to Naga and check it out. So until the next video, guys. Bye. 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 <laughs> and bye. He's starting to cry again. See, guys, you could have this if you wanted it. <laughs> Just get the right no. lady. <laughs>